you know, it's me, your little boy, or something. You know, let me tell you, choosing ones. Your enemies are totally so tired. They are wounded, bro. These force are wounded because wherever you put your leg, you are favored. You know what I'm saying? Let me tell you, the Bible said in the book of Deuteronomy that we are blessed mostly whatsoever we put our hand. Anywhere we match, we possessed. Let me tell you, choose this. There are people who have believed within them that as long as they are not with you, as long as they are not around you, as long as they did not support you, you will never get to where you are today. You know, this is what some people told me when I was in my what in my critical situation. This is what someone told me when I was going through the hair. But all glory be to God that he disappointed the vices and proved them wrong. You know, let me tell you two things. You have no idea how God frustrates your enemy. You have no idea. You know, many of you have no idea that a lot of people were earnestly waiting to be celebrating by now. A lot of people were earnestly waiting to jubilate by now. Trust me. I'm not trying to cast cool. I'm not trying to make it sound funny. But there are people up there who were earnestly believing that by this time they will be jubilating. They're supposed to be what? They're supposed to be rejoicing. They're supposed to be jumping up and down. They're supposed to be, you know, jubilating over what they did, over their plan that. As long as they don't support you, as long as they are not with you, as long as they have walked away, nothing good will ever come from you. That all that they will be hearing about you is just chaos. All that they will be hearing about you is just done for. All that they will be hearing about you is just what? You know, disappointment. All that they will be hearing about you is just that, is just what? Failure. But what shocked them is that the God whom you serve is more powerful than what they use or what they, what they tried to use to peel you down. What frustrates them is that all that they tried to use to make your grant not to be productive, to make the works of your hand not to be productive, none of them work out. You know, you have a lot of people who thought nothing good, you know, wherever you go, you will never be productive. Wherever you go, you will never be favored. You will never amount for something. You will never increase. You will never excel. You will never progress. That everything about you will just be chaos. Everything about you, it will just be cost. That whatsoever you do, everything you do with your hand, nobody will ever notice you. But what shocked them is that God disappointed them. That right now, everything you are putting in your hand, you are progressing. Wherever you enter, people are, you know, people are, are you know, are, 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 and you are now the center of attraction of everything. That wherever you go, you are blessed. You come in, you are blessed. You have, wherever you match your feet, you do what you possessed for good. You dominate. You are prospering. You are excelling right in front of them. And this is why they are seriously so sick. Trust me, you have no idea the kind of pain a lot of people up there are going through, bro. You have no idea that there are people up there who are absolutely so sick because of the fact that everything is working out. Because of the fact that they cost you, but yet your body refuses it. They cost you, but your spirit refuses it. They try to afflict you, but your spirit refuses it. They try to make you go down, but your spirit refuses it. They try to cost you sickness, but your body refuses it. They try to make things work, not work out good for you, but go, your body refuses it. That they try to create what danger and damages into your life, but your spirit and your body re do, do what refuse it. And this is why they don't like you, because everything about you is not authentic. Remember blessed.